Hello everyone and welcome back to the More Than Modern Tournament here at Grey Ogre Games. My name is Mick, I'm one of your hosts alongside Truth or Dare. Mr. Jeffrey Chan. And uh, yeah, this is our weekly Modern Tournament. We're here in yeah. round three. Thank yeah, you for joining us. Yeah, round. Uh, this is the last round for the night. But of course, yeah. this is not the yes. last round that we stream. Yeah. Uh, you can join us this weekend. Hey, you just subscribe to Power Run Podcast. Yay! <laughs> Thank you, Andrea. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you can join us yeah. uh, this weekend for our modern PPTQ Dublin. Yep. And uh, for those of you who do not know, Dublin is famous for a few things. Uh, most of all, it's music. But let's see what Dublin is famous for. Dublin. What? Googling. What is Dublin famous for? Uh. What's Dublin hmm, famous for? Dublin <laughs> Forum Trip Advisor. <laughs> what do they say? The no, I just heard that. Oh, Dubliner <laughs> cheese. Uh, Handel's classic Messiah was premiered for the first time here. So, again, lots of arts. Drink. I like this <laughs> response. Just drink. Like that. That's the that's the response. Turnover bread. Oh, that's cool. Uh. There's a bread shop, okay, so turnover bread. Cool. So food and um food, drink and music. Yeah. I think Oh yeah, right, right, Guinness. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Dublin. Guinness comes from Dublin. Jeffrey Chad. <laughs> Hi <laughs> uh, LSV wheel. <laughs> Is it? No, I don't know. No, no, it's a it's a yeah. hamster running, you know. <laughs> Yeah, I believe Ian is playing the same ad nauseum that we see uh Mat- Marie was playing previously. And I believe on the other side is is a Nahiri is a Madu Nahiri control. Oh, nice. Yeah. So mm. this is about the fight between the discard spell and how Combo. Ian yeah survived through the discard spell. Yeah, uh Wow, no. No, oh, it's, it's a classic. Oh, no, it's, it's not. It it's, a, is it's a Nahiri Varaku. Oh, I, oh yeah. I know. Uh, The Titan... Um, Titan Bridge. Prime, yeah, Titan Bridge deck. Titan Bridge with the Nahiri. Yeah. Which is very... Wow, yeah. okay. Yeah. So people do love the Nahiris, yeah. yeah if you, yeah, if you can splash in white. If you're playing red, you can splash in white. If you I think Nahiri is a first style card, yeah. Yeah. But it's just that I think it's lost a lot of luster when it came out from... Uh, what is it called? The uh, Eldritch Moon. So, yeah. yeah. Because uh, the decks have adapted to so sort of like Nahiri's. negate uh, the effect of Nahiri. Yeah. Nahiri is much more easier to play around after now, yeah, yeah. After people got used to what is, hap- what is going on. Yeah, but still, now now that's the thing. Like, it's it's being used in modern so much. So, yeah. uh, you know, it, it becomes... It, it's, it's good. Like it's good. It's good. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's just... No, <laughs> just now, yeah. yeah. It just good only. But it's not being used yeah. in standard a lot anymore. Yeah. So yeah. Uh you played a in LA Red Green Breach with Nahiri. But uh yeah, you're saying Nahiri is a trap. Ultimate her zero times in thirteen <laughs> rounds you play. <laughs> oh, yeah. Man. Usually yeah. I mean in a skip shift that is pretty hard to out Nahiri because you don't really have a lot of removers and then you most of your stuff is just about ramping. Although you can turn three Nahiri if you if you, if you Sakura try order on turn two. Exactly. You yeah. fast seek or Sakura try yeah. order on turn two, right? True. Uh, here Ian setting up. Oh, yeah. Ian is not running his normal Tron uh, eggs deck. No, it it looks just, like he's yeah. running at nauseum. Yeah, he's playing at nauseum. All he's right, playing the so. same deck as Marin. Just now, uh, after the game has ended, I, I saw Ian was like combo consulting, out. no consulting with uh Marin about what how to play the deck. Ah, okay. Yeah. Uh, All right. So uh, Ian taking on uh you know new decks. With the PPTQ, PPTQ no, mm-hmm. uh, with the PPTQ this weekend as well as the WMCQ that's coming up, I think players are very anxious about uh, what they're what they're yeah. going to try to play. Cause Ad Nauseum is not a very uh, popular deck, so if you really know how to pilot it very well, you can catch people off guard most often. Turn yeah. three, eighteen damage with through the bridge and prime time. Yes. Yeah, that prime is time insane. is good. Uh, turn one you go. Turn one you go. Um, the uh, uh, search, search for, for tomorrow. tomorrow. Second turn you fasting. Fasting. Then third turn you you drop. Uh, the search tomorrow suspend counter off. Then you have five mana. So you through the bridge. Yeah, through the bridge. There you go. Uh, it's 
So does he have No you need 5 mana For true bridge But you have Nahiri so Oh Micah Micah missed a land drop Last turn Did he? Yeah he did Oh no okay. He went Otherwise Turn 2 far sick Turn 3 far sick Then uh, Then he He finally drew another land So oh, his okay. hand now Has the combo piece through the bridge and Primal Titan. Uh, yeah, but, Ian, but that deals you only, what, 18 points of damage? Yeah, 18. Double, uh, double Valakut and then Valakut land? Or just double mountain? Uh, it's usually, it's enter battlefield, Valakut, Valakut, then attack, then you get two mountains, two mountains which will deal chop damage, then Primal Titan will hit for yeah. six, yeah. So, let's see. Uh, Ian... You know, Yen not in any danger of dying right now. He's yeah, still yeah. got 20 points of life, so yeah. it's fine. It's you know, what's K. the important thing that... Uh, the fact that oh, the... Shit, he's got Valakut now. So that means, you know, Yen's dead. Like, if... Yeah, but I think Yen might have stopped the pack in his hand. So he okay. can technically stop the Primal Titan from attacking. Alright, so true breach here. Yeah. Gonna drop an Emraku. Oh, oh my no, god. No. If you have Emraku, why not just cast it, right? Yeah. Why not just bring it down? Uh, lay the lay the smack of down. <laughs> oh my god! When did he have the Maku? I didn't yeah, realize did it. Not realize. Yeah, surprise, oh, man. man. Uh, I mean, I don't think the Anoison that can survive through the Ima uh, annihilation trigger from Imaku. Jeez, did not see that coming, people. Yeah, I didn't uh, even realize. Yeah, yeah. I thought his hand was Titan, Titan, Vaku. Now his hand is for Titan, Titan, Vaku. Yeah. Wow. And then through the bridge. So when did he draw the... I think Emraku? he has the Imraku in his starting hand. Oh yeah. my goodness. I believe his hand was Rastemire, Farsic, uh, Nahiri, Two Lands, Pure Titan, through the bridge. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah, so so I yeah, think I was discussing with, I think, uh, Joshua just now mm -hmm. about uh, having, being able to, uh, uh, what do you call it? Uh, what? Emraku on turn three. I don't yeah. think it's worth it. You do it on like turn four, turn uh sorry turn four or five. I mean against a deck we have no counter magic. Yeah, they'll probably turn four turn five. I yeah. mean if there's a if a blue deck definitely tap out, I'm gonna smack then him. You do it like as it, fast as I you don't can, care right? what the hell happened to Rimaku. I turn just two. want you to have nothing on turn four. Turn two yeah. Simeon Spirit Guide and then uh, yeah. turn two Simeon Spirit Guide Faithless Looting Gorios Vengeance yeah. and uh, yeah enjoy. Yeah. Uh, sec, wow, sec, six permanent six first. permanence. Yeah, yeah. Ouch. Okay, Ian left with three mana. Is he able yeah. to do anything though? Uh, he still, you know, he actually might be able to still win. He's got two Simeon Spirit guys in hand. Yeah, uh, if he has nah, he has five cards, so his hand has to be land. He has to draw a land. Simeon Spirit guy, Simeon Spirit guy, and nausea and Angel Grace. Yeah. Yeah, that's the only way of doing so. Wow, yeah. this is an uphill battle. Yeah. He's gonna shuffle everything. If he doesn't back, do so, then the ultimate Nahiri will bring back the Imaku again, then the game will end. Alright, so you drew it the same turn he cast the Nahiri. Okay, so that means the discard. So we missed that we missed that draw. Yeah, I missed guess. that draw step. Yeah. Uh so yeah, we always boast about we have hundred percent even no, we don't have hundred percent information. Yes. Oh, oh, he draw land, land but and, nah. and the perfect land, man. Does it? No, it doesn't matter. His one yeah. of his cards in his hand was a sort of pack, which would dealt with the film writer if e Michael did not have <laughs> the, the Emraku. Yeah. Wow, that was a quick game. The Stone that Cold Turn Five Maku, you know, yeah, Turn, turn, turn five, four, five, Turn Five, five yeah. Yeah, Turn Five. Yeah, yeah. it was basically just kill you because Emraku will kill you. And even if that did not work, which I do not see how that does not work, yeah. um, you know, it, it's still going to get you. Get ya. Wow. <laughs> this Out of nowhere, man. <laughs> Out of nowhere. So maybe no, it is worth this, to have the, this deck the is like, package. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's worth it. This deck is like having a cow... Cow, cow, uh, cowboy duo like that. Then you just see who's revolver shot off first. <laughs> you have one bullet in the six, in, in the six, six chamber, uh, in yeah. the six chamber. Pa, 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 see who will hit, <laughs> hit the bullet first. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Michael hit it first. So whether Ian on the play will get the game back, uh, is up to how, it's how like, well his draw will be. <laughs> it's like that scene. Now uh, you know. Are you feeling lucky? <laughs> You fire. <laughs> you must be thinking to yourself, did I fire five shots or six? Yeah, five shots or six. You feeling lucky, pal? Hi. <laughs> uh, Hi, is disgusting, yeah. by the way. <laughs> yeah. 
has competitive started? I haven't been playing. No, I don't um, think so. I haven't been playing yeah. Overwatch in quite uh, a while. No. You know what's the funny thing? What? Ian's sleeve is, is an Imraku sleeve. Uh, and he just got Imraku! <laughs> he cannot whack my Imraku. Yeah! No. I catch a glimpse of it. <laughs> it was too painful. <laughs> uh, man, I love the flavor of Imraku. Yeah. Like, just even True. looking at Imraku like, drives you mad. Um, yeah. I'm running the D&D campaign into the abyss. The same thing. Uh, madness. Um... Uh, you can gain levels of madness if you oh. look at things that are horrific to you. So oh. it's really quite fun. It's like how the Jays walk through the san- his own sanctum tr- while being the influence while of being, Imaku. Yeah. Uh, the the storyline during then was like the like inception level. Yeah. Like I Imaku, don't remember Imaku being... Imaku chose to be prison, in prison on his own uh, dis- uh, will. Of his own oh, will. he did? He I did haven't it. read the he last did. story yet. Oh, the Tamiyo and the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I read the second last yeah. one which is... Uh, so I haven't been reading it yet, but yeah. uh, the second last one is the one where they shift between characters and like how they are. Yeah, yeah. Well, just well, just like, like visiting through the memories of yeah the yeah. the plane other planes walker. <laughs> yeah, it's quite interesting though the last one, but it's a fact that Imaku chose to be imprisoned by his own will. Oh, yeah. Andrea saying those sleeves look like origins checklists that have been blacked out. That is really cool. We should have. <laughs> uh, Man, we should yeah. have checklist cards that have all al- that have altered blackout. art on it. No, I saw the That'll blackout, really cool. the blackout version when the checklist. I know you yeah, blackout yeah, everything and then only the thing, this thing right? That I saw those done very nicely. Yeah, my yeah. friend in Porto does that. Yeah. Uh, with with all the checklist cards that he has, so he has yeah. a playset of each of the cards, and then he blacks out. Uh, but yeah, how about having altered art? For check what? Yeah, for, for check this. So you so you black out everything else uh-huh. and you only leave the name there and after that you alter art you, you put around art it, around uh. it. Well that's that would be really just, that's just that's a lot of effort level, already. Yeah. I would pay for what those. Kind of, what kind of art do you want to put for each play for card? I know it depends yeah. uh, it depends on what the card is. If it's like Lone Rider then you put like you maybe, maybe you put the 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 oaf symbol. But which one does not have oaf? I wouldn't even oh, mind. Oh, all, all the, all the, all the planes are oh, oh, so you can put the. Oh, yeah, oh, exactly. Yeah. No, I wouldn't even mind if it's like stick figures, like the uh, cardboard crack style. Uh, cardboard crack style. <laughs> <laughs> I got a hey, fire. <laughs> 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 but what flip cards has Chandra? What, what the uh, red flip cards? Red and, flip uh, cards, Chandra. I don't think there is any. Yeah, no, but like red, red flip cards in general. What are there? There's the werewolves that flip. Oh, it's yeah. always about well. Gaia Reach. Gaia Reach. Um, Hang- Hangwell, that's all. Hangwell flip to colors. Oh, yeah, the Hangwell one. Yeah. No, but then if. The, the yeah. Chandra, I really Chandra, you can put, put the ghost fire. <laughs> 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 I mean, yeah. Uh, uh, he did manage to cast the ghost fire before. Yeah. Uh, Andre, Andre Cooper, you're asking Breach versus Ad Nauseam. Yes, you are right. Uh, Ian yeah. is playing Ad Nauseam. Mm-hmm. So he's on the left side. Yeah. And uh, the bridge player is yes. on the right side. Michael playing um, yeah. bridge titan. The only indication that you know your opponent is playing Ad is either A, turn 1 suspend, Lotus Bloom. B, Slide turn 1 temper. Uh, oh, no, temper. Turn 1 temper. The temper. This is the only deck that runs temper in the modern format. Well, if you're not rich like myself, you also run temples. No, yeah. but I don't run temples. I use <laughs> the uh, check lens. <laughs> uh, bridge is indeed very strong though. Yeah. Uh, looking to be, you know what? Let's go check out the meta game, Grand Prix Lil. I think Kwang Cho also had some um breach, breach decks, right? No. In the uh, top yeah, eight, yeah. yeah top so eight top eight, eight there was one, one in uh GP. I think Kwang Cho don't have any though. Kwang Cho and yeah, Kwang Cho no, did not have any, and um. Yeah, there's Balakut Bridge as well. Scott Lip. Yeah, yeah uh, Scott Lip. Indiana Scott Lip is uh, very consistent. I think he made two top eight in a row. Wow. He won the okay. won the GP oh, recently. No. Second, second place also, Rob Bissan. Oh, Rob wow, Bissan, yeah. yeah. The Balakut is indeed powerful. I mean, Ooh. it's a very straightforward deck. And yeah, once once the Titan really come off. I mean, there's two ways of winning with the deck. But yeah, through the bridge is a very powerful card. Yeah. Your opponent have really have no way to interact if your opponent is not playing blue. Gorio's Vengeance is a well, I won't say narrow, but it's not as yeah, good. Yeah, it's yeah, it's not as good because of the lack of inconsistency. Yeah, through the bridge. If you never draw through the bridge, you can just manually cast the your normal titans or 
Just Titan. I don't think you can cast Imaku. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> uh, yeah. Murgia Lago, you want those dice. Well, unfortunately, we want more of those dice. It's easier <laughs> for us to... Or the uh, sponge dice? Yeah. <laughs> the sponge dice, yeah, you can get it. Yeah, the sponge dice, though. yeah, you can go. Yeah, we got it from the arcade, though. <laughs> that was in America, right? Oh, uh, yeah, man. America. Okay, so it looks oh, like Ian's going to go got it. Fire... Yep, I draw everything, then so the lightning storm will come out. Where's the, yep, one Simeon Spirit Guide, two Simeon Spirit Guide, two, three Simeon Spirit Guide. Wow, it's and Spirit Guide. And lightning really storm will be cast off the three rate from the uh, uh, Simeon Spirit Guide. This is a turn three yeah. kill, right? Yeah, no, turn one, two, three. No, it's a, uh, yeah, yeah, it's turn three kill. kill. Turn three kill. Yep, and Michael just yeah. like looks at Ian and yeah. like, okay, cool. Yeah, <laughs> just in case you all didn't know what was happening, uh, Ian casts an injured grace uh, and then proceed by casting an Enosium. Enosium uh, causes a life loss through every card you draw that has a converted mana cost on it. Yeah. Uh, and Enosium say, uh, no, injured grace say you don't lose the game uh, so by having a life total less, being less than, less than one. one. Right? Anything that causes your life total to go less than one. Just no, no, no. It it's one. damage only. Injured grace oh, okay, just right, says right, you, don't, you, yeah, you don't lose yeah, the game. You don't lose the game. Your so, life total goes below. Yeah, Ian proceeds to draw the whole die deck, then you exile three Simeon's Spirit Guide to cast Lightning Storm from his hand. Lightning uh, Storm, on the other hand, that's uh, the key card. Uh, Lightning Storm is a very confusing card. Okay, wait, wait, yeah, so yeah, I want to pull up uh, Lightning Storm so that we get the, um, yeah, the, get the Oracle text. text yeah. Lightning Storm. Storm. Okay, so Lightning Storm. Uh, so it deals X damage to target creature or player where X is 3 plus the number of charge counters on it and then you can discard a card so while it's on the stack yep. discard a card put 2 charge counters on lightning storm you may choose a new target for it any player may activate this ability but only if lightning storm is on the stack yes. so basically you draw your entire deck you, yeah. you definitely lands. have more lands than your opponent yeah, since your this, entire deck is time, right, yeah, yeah. at this point of time you have so many lands in your hand and then you proceed to just, to just discard, uh, yeah, yeah, discard discard maybe 10 lands if your opponents are maybe higher life total yeah. and then just proceed to burn your opponent even if your opponent has his lands in his head there's no way you can fight you over can it. fight over so many lands yeah. like you have you have yeah. 24 minus X number of lands on the battlefield so yeah. it's going to be fun and interactive yeah yes, that's fun definitely interactive. Yeah. definitely interactive yeah. game. one of the ways to like beat lightning uh, the end of the day is maybe like uh, if you can probably like sort of game take away the lightning storm then the deck almost has no wing con left yeah yeah. That's right. Oh, although they have one left usually they have a secondary wing con in the form of laboratory minute uh, either lab minute I've seen yeah. some versions with conflagrate uh, but yeah, that one that's is off sideboard. Though. That's yeah. off the sideboard, yeah. yeah. And uh, usually you yeah. run a bit slower. Yeah. And looks like they're gonna start off uh to like redirecting Lightning Storm to Kira playing more folks. How do you redirect it to Kira though? You discard a land and choose Kira. Oh okay, target. okay, right. No la, if you discard a land then why don't you just point it back at the guy? So you force does it force a spell to get countered? Uh, it does force the oh, spell it does to get, get counter, yeah. yeah, so it will trigger the Kira ability of countering the lightning ah, storm. Ah, okay, okay, right. Wow, right. that's an interesting that's interaction. Good, I have no idea that would happen. point. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Murgui Lago, you are good at the game, man. Nice. Yeah, so now we yeah. know play more. This is a situation before. that doesn't come out. <laughs> Usually, the player <laughs> the player on the Enosium deck doesn't really go off when you're playing against Moho deck. <laughs> hey, you never yeah. know, man. Once yeah. he like dumps all the lands, right? And then he, and then no, no, he's not dump all the land. He, he dumps on, X you, number you, of lands. You, you dump X on the land, then you on the stack, then you discard your own land, triggering the to redirect the lightning storm to, to the Kira, Kira yeah. trigger the Kira ability. So it doesn't matter whether your opponent has another land or whatsoever. Because Man, that the is counter good stuff. Kira ability will be on a stack, then you'll be forced to resolve. No, but that's the thing, like you keep your Edelval untapped, like Edelval on tree, yeah. and then just like your opponent just has no clue like what's happening. Yeah. Oh man. That's cute. That is a yeah. very the cool fact that It's on the stack, there's no way of your opponent disrupting the yeah. Kira ability too. Yeah. <laughs> man. Mm. Interesting, interesting. Idea. Wow. Play more folk, man. Play more yeah, folk. I <laughs> proof. Although the Merfolk Aren't you a mo your Merfolk yeah. guy right from uh, did, did the Merfolk make top 8 Of any of the Triple uh, GP I believe so there I think one of it did. Um Lille GP Lil I think GP Lil didn't This is not a This is the Calvin Chu That's Calvin Chu's 
No. Nah, the merfolk. Merfolk is now although Merfolk's he... not in favorable in yeah. the game anymore. True, uh, true. Although still quite a lot of yeah. players do play it. I heard the merfolk now uh incomplete like some some of the merfolk plays the white the white blue version and incorporate the spell color. I actually prefer the white blue version. Like honestly speaking, even from way back when, uh, I prefer yeah, the white yeah, blue yeah. version yeah. because you got access to stony science. Really, yeah, yeah, stony science. You got access to such good yeah. removal. Yeah. So. Yeah, it's preferable to have a white blue version, but the mono blue version is just powerful enough too. The white blue version has the mana base sometimes does come back to bite you. Uh, that's yeah, true. Yeah. yeah, that's true. Alright, so Michael here uh, getting relatively fast start. Turn 3 mana on turn 3. Probably got access to a 4th land, which uh, will be Valakut, possibly. Can yeah, redirect can. Lightning Storm to Spell Sky? Yep, you can. Yes, you but can. But you got to keep paying life, 2 life for every uh, every land every that your land, opponent yeah. discards. Your opponent can keep, keep re redirecting the... The lightning storm back to your face too. Mm. Unfortunately, yeah, it does not work as well as Kira does. <laughs> yeah. Kira is like one ultimate. Wow. I think he has almost a combo in his yes. He has Angel Grace. And then he's he got Pack of Negation as well. So yeah, Pack of Negation and, and Nausea too. He's got everything yeah. set up. Although he's, if he's forced to use the Angel... Uh, oh, no, no. If Pack of Negation, he can always Angel Grace on his upkeep to prevent him from dying. So he doesn't have to pay yeah. for the pack. Uh, yeah. And now he's got the... Uh, but he doesn't have the Nausea though. Yeah. Hey. yeah. Oh, he doesn't. He doesn't, doesn't okay, so yeah. he's got everything else except uh, Nausea. Uh, oh, they're going to destroy crush. the yeah. uh, Pentad Prism. Pentad Prism. Yeah, the Ancient Grudge will. If Michael doesn't have the Through the Bridge, the Ancient Grudge is going to be flashback to eat the Lotus Bloom. Yeah, it's yeah. coming off the yes. Suspend Count. No, Lotus mm. Bloom comes out there as suspect. Flashback, count. flashback. And do it, do it now. You no. got to do it. No, do before it I draw. Yes, before I draw. Do it now. Do it now. You, you got to do it. Nothing to do, just. Yeah, he's going to do it. Weed. On the red mana. Wow. One red mana? It's one no, green. Yeah, one it's green. It's green, it's green. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah trying know. to look at the cost. Uh, No, he has to pay a green sauce. Oh my god. Okay, forget he drew yeah, it. Yeah, and him. Wow, he drew it and I was off the draw face. He drew it, people. This is how good you are at the game. <laughs> draw it. L O L. Yeah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Yes. And I was here. It's all, yeah. He found his uh the one bullet in the chamber. Earlier. I believe LSV said it best. Luck skill, skill. luck skill. Then he victory. didn't say the luck skill victory. It's someone is uh, a Twitch. Uh, yeah. I think it's. Oh yeah, yeah. Somebody make just make a uh what is it called like description of LSV. Yeah, luck, luck skill, skill victory. victory. No, he brought it up. He brought it up during mm? uh oh. during some of the uh magic Interview. tournaments. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> where he, was, where he was doing the casting because yeah. uh, he picks he picks it up during yeah, his yeah. his Twitch streams. Anyway, thank you uh, for joining us. Uh, congratulations to Ian for winning that very interactive game of Magic. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, so yeah. To be truthful, yeah, I believe the Valkyrie deck is an underdog anyway. Yeah. It is, it is. Yeah. Uh, against this deck, like, it, not a lot that it can do. Yeah, really it's not a lot. Really not a lot. Uh, bringing in the... Um, the Ancient Grudge. Yeah, it does help to slow down, but as you can see, yeah, it doesn't... It doesn't do that much if just your opponent really have yeah, the yeah, uh, if your opponent have the perfect draws. But both of you are playing relative. Both of you are playing combo decks. Yeah. So yeah. you know, just one person yeah. needs to go off like faster than the but other. But the fact that if you don't through the bridge, the uh, Imaku, like what Michael did on turn one, is even the through the bridge Pyramid doesn't doesn't end the game. On yeah, it only turn, does yeah. like eighteen points yeah. of damage unless you already have another Valakut on the battlefield. Yeah, so yeah, then yeah. that ends the game. Does anyway, no, you'd have to go. Okay, if his mana base was Valaku and four mountain, then he looked for Valaku, Valaku, then attack, look for. No, doesn't. Oh, four mountain, yeah, four yeah, mountain. Yeah, 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 that works, that works. Just enough, it's yeah. just enough. I think yeah. you do. Uh, just 18 slightly. damage from the double mountain. Yeah, then 24 six, damage. Yeah, yep. Exactly 24. Uh, all right, so thanks for joining us on the stream today. Uh, remember, if you like what you're watching, you can join us on the other, other days that we stream. Tuesdays, we do uh, standard, and Wednesdays, we do modern. Yep. And sometimes on the weekends, we have tournaments, like this weekend. Modern Sunday. PBDQ, yeah, which PBDQ is PBDQ yeah, Dublin. qualify for Dublin, which is uh, for Pro Tour Color Dash. Yep. Uh, is that Pro Tour Color Dash? The second set. Second, is it second set. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah second after, set. The uh, first set, is yeah. second set, which we I don't know why it's the abbreviation for. Uh <laughs> yeah, I I forget what's the yeah. name. Anyway, uh, 
So if you want to keep updated, make sure you follow this Twitch channel. Make sure you follow our Facebook page because we put all the updates there as well. And uh, you, if you want to watch replays, you can catch them either on this channel or you go to our YouTube page. Just go there and type in Grey Ogre Games. I realize that YouTube is making it hard for me to change the, um, the, the name again. Oh. The name of the channel. <laughs> so it doesn't allow me to put uh, youtube.com slash Games. We will go and settle this with YouTube. All right. Uh, no, we are taking vintage out of the, um, streaming, out of, uh, yeah. the streaming circulation because, uh, yeah, just uh, we're looking for new avenues to bring you more content. Uh, mm -hmm. But we do have a replays of our vintage on the YouTube page. So yep. uh, if you're ever lonely, if you ever wanted to you know, learn more about vintage, you can go there. Uh, finally, all the links are in the description below, by the yep. way. Uh, finally, you uh, pay our partners a little visit, power9podcast.com. Every week, myself and Alfian, we get together and uh, yeah, we just talk shop about Magic the Gathering. This week, we talk about Conspiracy 2 and how much fun we had. Oh, so much fun. No, really, really. <laughs> we, we had a lot of fun. I'm not being sarcastic. Uh, so yeah, just join us there. And until next time, actually, on You're Always Lonely, Forever Alone. Uh, I'm forever alone. Anyway, until next time, which will be this Sunday, uh, we'll catch you guys soon. Thanks again for watching. Yep. Thank you, guys. Ciao.